What's up guys, my name is Aaron Bailey. I'm owner of Fitness by Design Personal Training in Nashville, New Hampshire. It's December again. It's so crazy how time flies. And you've made it through Thanksgiving. Hopefully without getting too much weight, am I right? <laughs> so I'm here to talk about weight loss. Weight loss seems very complicated to most people. But I've got some news for you. It really doesn't have to be. Weight loss is as simple as calories in and calories out. So a pound of fat is 3,500 calories. So if you consume 500 less calories than you do normally, or burn an extra 500 calories each day from working out, you'll lose one pound of fat each week. It's that simple. Calories in, calories out. You just have to be in a caloric deficit. So with that being said, here are some tips to lose weight during the holidays. Number one, don't overeat. So there's tons of random desserts to eat during Thanksgiving, Christmas, New Year's, Valentine's Day, and Easter. And yes, I wanted to list them all to show you how many times people make excuses to why they're off their diet. I mean, my favorite dessert on the holidays is pumpkin pie. So if you're gonna have your favorite dessert, like me and pumpkin pie, just have a normal serving amount. Don't overthink it, just have a normal serving. But also, don't leave it laying around your house, eating it every day, claiming, ooh, I don't wanna waste, because I'm willing to bet you threw out your carrots and green beans last night, Sharon. <sighs> so ashamed of Sharon. Sharon, I'm just so ashamed of you. Come on, Sharon. What do you think? Ah. Number two. Work out after work. So this time of year, there's less daylight. This causes people to be more lazy and snuggle up on the couch earlier and longer than they normally do in the warmer months. If you make a routine of going to the gym every day after work during those darker parts of the day, you'll burn the same amount of calories, if not more, than you normally do during the warmer months. Number three, get a personal trainer. A personal trainer will be able to customize a plan specifically for you, no matter what level of fitness you're at currently. You'll have a clear set plan and all the motivation you need to stay healthy during this holiday season. Number four, get started early. The new year is in a month, so instead of starting when the crowd starts, be a trailblazer. Start when you want to start. Have a proactive mindset. Create a solid routine before the new year's resolutioners, who generally quit after a month, start. This is an investment in yourself. So let's make it happen. Ah!